Hi everyone, in this tutorial, we're going to edit the Dawn team. We're going to edit the pictures or the images in the product page of the Dawn team. So right here, click action and then let me see the preview. So what I'm talking about is this big image right here. It's just quite so big. If you guys want to decrease the size of this image and then increase the size of this um, product info right here, then this is a good tutorial for you. First, we have to um, inspect. So I'm going to tell you how I did it so you can do it uh, in the future for yourself. And what we're going to do is to right click on this image and inspect. And then here we have everything highlighted here whenever you hover on this one. So what we're going to do is just close this one. And we are looking for something that affects the whole, all the images. So for here, it's the product underscore media wrapper. And when you click this one, um, we can see that we have a max dash width here. And um, you can also uh, click this one. And then when you, when it's highlighted, you can scroll up and down so you can adjust it. For this one, I'm going to set it to 45 and see where we at. 45 seems good. Maybe 50. Uh, maybe 50 is good. Okay. I think 50 is better, right? So now we will adjust this product info. So we have to find a wrapper as well for the product info because the wrapper are the one who responsible on wrapping the elements so we're just going to close this one so here we have the product underscore info wrapper and click that one and then we also have a max width so in here we can just adjust the width and let's see uh 50 maybe um 50 50 seems okay. And if you want to adjust it like here in the middle, you can adjust the padding um, dash left. So you can put it up or down to adjust. Um, for me, I'm just going to put a five rim for this one. And I believe, yeah, that's it. Huh? That's good. It looks good. But how do we find which one is this one in our... um? In our store, I mean, in our team, how do we edit the team? To do that, we can click this one, um, link right here. Click that one, and it will tell you where it's where the folder is. So in here, if you read it, it's an HTTPS um, CDN Shopify .com files, and in here it has an assets. So that give you a hint where it is. It's an assets and it has a section dash main dash product that's CSS. So that's what we're going to look for. So in our store, we're going to go to um, actions. We're going to click the actions and then edit the team that you want. But for me, I'm going to edit this one and then click edit code. And then let's make this bigger. So let's click this button right here. And we're looking for assets folder, right? So assets folder, and um, it is section dash main dash product. So let's find that one. So it's section dash main dash product. So let's click this one. And we're looking for, um, first is for the product info. So we're looking for this info product right here and it's the padding left and the max width so um you can control f and say um info and i see here there's a bunch but we're looking for this um particular one that has a nut and nut so this one so this is what we're looking for so we set our padding when we go to our elements again. We set our padding as 5 rem. And we're going to do it here. 
and then also our max width was um 50 so we'll do it here as well so 50 and then in our product underscore media wrapper we set our max width at 50 and you can also click this one again and find but uh, it's easier to find because it's just on the top of the product that underscore info so here we just set this one to 50 and click save and then when you preview again you should have the changes so let's see here yeah that's that's good now um let's go click inspect and you should see the one that we just edited so we are looking for a product wrapper product major wrapper so yes we have 50 here and when we close this one we can see the product info is five rim and 50. and that's it that's how you edit the the size of the image thank you so much for watching